Today's home DIY is about fixing the cracks on the wall right here by the gate. And to do that, we're going to use caulking to cover up the cracks and then pre-mix stucco to finish it off before we have it painted. When I replaced the RV gate, the guys actually ended up cracking the uh, stucco area. So what happened is I just kind of left it alone for a while, but now I decided I want to actually repair the cracks on there. And so I decided to, well, repair it and then paint it. So right here, I'm doing the caulking first. And I'm using this tool, which actually is not very useful. In hindsight, I should have just used my fingers, which eventually I did. And just using this for sort of demo purposes while, while I'm holding the camera. But reality is better to just use your fingers in a damp cloth. Right there, there's a big crack. But eventually I just spread everything, the caulking, all the way down. Now that I put the uh, caulking on the cracks, I'm just going to wait a little bit till it dries out. Now we can add the uh, pre-mixed stucco after caulking to cover up the cracks. So I purchased this pre-made stucco from Home Depot and this was more than enough to cover the uh, cracked areas right here by the gate. And it's not the same as the caulking because it's not as sticky. You just kind of have to apply it a little bit more. Eventually it sticks too, but you just have to be more careful I think or be more um, what do you call it you, you just need to sort of make sure it sticks to the wall a little bit better because it's not like the caulking paste which just kind of sticks to it so you want to spread it as evenly as you can it's not going to be perfect but at least it's going to cover the crack you know? so like I was saying you do have to spread it evenly and it's uh, not that hard to do but up here as you notice there was a big hole up there and I just covered it with the stucco Right here, all the parts that had caulking, I just covered it up with stucco. And then I'm just gonna wait till it dries up. And once it's dry, then I'm gonna be ready to paint. So now that the uh, caulking and the... Okay, so now that the caulking and the stucco is dry, it's time to get it painted. To make sure that the stucco is dry, I waited a whole day before I did my touch-up paint. And I just wanted to cover up the white areas of the stucco to make it match the wall better. It didn't match completely because the wall is old. So eventually what I did was I just repainted the whole wall. But that's not really the issue. I just wanted to show how I got rid of the cracks with the caulking and the stucco. Finally got it painted. As you can see right there, it doesn't match perfect, so I don't know if I'm just going to repaint the whole wall, but that's pretty much it. You just take care of the cracks, and once the caulking and the stucco dries up, then you can paint the walls. And then you decide whether you want to paint the whole wall and stuff like that. So that's going to do it. Until next time, stay safe and keep on rolling.